Are you mean enough? Are you brutal? Are you without mercy? Then you and a friend could win the grand prize and meet one of the American Angels. They're a group of ladies who know how to have a killer good time. The American Angels, guys, gals. Call 1-900-454-1-ANGEL. Then tell me in 30 seconds less why you are tough enough to win a trip to New York or Los Angeles with me. Whoa! Forget her. She's a wimp. You want to party with me? Yeah. You think you can handle it? Whoa! You want to party? Then pick a real woman. Me. Porque ella ya está fuera del ring. Ladies, go to your neutral corners. Now, as for you at home, you just call 1-900-454-1-ANGEL. Leave the reason why you should be the one to meet with one of these Hellcats, and you'll automatically be entered in the grand prize drawing for you and a friend to meet an angel in either New York or Los Angeles, where you'll whine and dine and have front row seats at an action-packed wrestling match for a knockdown, drag-out good time. Not only that, you could win one of thousands of instant prizes, like... An autographed photo. Not bad, huh? Or the American Angels video cassette. And if you won, you'll get a second chance to enter into the grand prize drawing if you can answer two incredibly easy questions about the American Angels video. It's easy. And almost as much fun as breaking heads. You'll love it. But before you go into the ring, or, or should I say give us a ring, here's what our lawyers have to say. Each call is $2 for the first minute and $1.50 for each additional minute. Limit two calls per day per person. So don't overdo a good thing. Call 1-900-454-1-ANGEL or here's how to enter with no purchase or phone call necessary. You may send a 3x5 card with your name and address to Meet the Angels, Post Office Box 76779, Los Angeles, California, 90076. Open to all U.S. residents 18 years old and older, void where prohibited. Sweepstakes begin September 13, 1990 and ends January 31st, 1991. All entries must be postmarked by February 2nd and received by February 8, 1991. Grand prize drawing will be held on February 11th, 1991. For official rules, send a self-addressed stamp envelope to Meet the Angels, Post Office Box 70339, Los Angeles, California, 90070. Limit one request per envelope. So, guys and gals, if you are B-A-double-D bad enough to meet an angel, call 1-900-454-1-ANGEL. Don't be afraid. We won't hurt you, will we, girl? No. Pleased to bring you our feature presentation.
think that they endure? How do they take it, Dr. Dave? You know how they take it. Mm -hmm. They take it because I'm the best trainer in the whole damn business. Well, that's true. And my angels can do anything. Yep. They are the most beautiful. Yes, and they are the baddest. Yep. And you know when I say bad, yep. I mean the double D. Bad. There you heard it from Diamond Dave, the Hollywood train. Look at this now. Mimi's just starting to have her way on Amy. Tremendous. <laughs> If I know, let me bring one thing to the attention of the fans. We are now coming to the end of the season for the American Angels, and that means you're going to be back on the road looking for more women to take the place of some of these girls out here. An interesting job you've got coming up, Donna, Dave. Yeah, it sure is going to be interesting. Oh, and I tell you what, maybe you can help with all those beautiful women out there in the audience. They're all going to have a chance to come to Hollywood and to be made a movie star. <laughs> I'll tell you what, a wrestling thing. star and to be one of you the better, angels. Baby. You better be rough and tough if you're going to be an American angel. As a matter of fact, if you look here now, Diamond Dave, it looks like some of the luster's off one of your stars. Amy's starting to do a number here on the Magnificent One. Amy's starting to get a little bit of trouble here, Diamond Dave. Oh, no, baby. That's the Magnificent One down there. She might be down, but she ain't out. Because she's going to come back and put the hurts on her like she always does. <laughs> You wish you'd never been born. Please, I don't want to die. This is my town! I own everything and everybody in it. Do you understand me? Huh? Yes! <laughs> please, please don't hurt me. Please. I don't want to die. Please. You ain't going to die, bitch. You ain't gonna die. Wanna do what you tell you to do? Hmm? Ah! Huh? You gonna do what you tell you? Yes. You gonna do what I tell you? Yes, yes, yes. yes. <laughs> How about some? You don't know. I got something I want you to do. I want you to make a little run for me. Deliver this package. Think you can do that, huh? And you know, if you don't do it, if you don't do it, you know what I'm gonna do to you? Huh, you know what I'm gonna do? 
poke out your eyes and piss in your brain. Part of the show. She makes a lot of money. 